morning, greetings, and salutations, YouTube. It's Eden here. Welcome to another episode of the vlog. It is a super like cloudy, overcasty day, and I don't know if you can tell on camera because it has like a color correction, but the light is like super yellowy orange, and it's just really like bleh outside. It's probably from all the ash. Whenever like there's any fires or anything like that, it makes all the light like yellow and orange and gross. Also, you can see like all the ash. It's like covering everything. Alright you guys, I have my little breakfast ready. I have leftover sushi from yesterday and then some coffee and mom's eating some leftover soup. Today's a leftover breakfast morning. <laughs> Alright you guys, I just finished packaging some stuff, so I'm going to go drop this off. Thank goodness for these giant boxes. Actually, that Walmart, I think it was at Walmart? I don't remember who sent that, but I saved, I saved all my boxes and packaging. And that really did come in very, very handy because I needed a huge box and this totally worked out. You guys have to see how cute these little birds are. They're all taking a bath in the bird, in the bird bath, in the fountain. Look at them go. Look at them. They're shaking their little bodies. Okay, so before I go to the post office, I wanted to vacuum the outdoor um, sofas and see how much ash is inside of them. I vacuum these almost every day, but I haven't vacuumed them these two days that it's been like really ashy and gross. So I, wanted, I emptied out the vacuum and see how much stuff is in here. So I don't know if it's picking up on camera, but look at how ashy and gross this is. Like, you can see it. Crazy. Oh my gosh. Look at this one. I think this one you can see more. Like, I just did, like, a little section of it. Crazy. I don't know if you can see it in the vacuum, but... There is a good amount of like ash and stuff in there. So gross. So much ash. You can see it really well. Do you see all that ash right there? Nuts. How much ash there is. So mom and I are gonna be skinny legends for lunch. And she has her little <laughs> meal prep salads that she made. So that is what we are eating before I head over to the post office. Alright you guys, we finally got inside the car. The package is, like that box was so huge. But um, we're gonna go to the post office and then maybe Trader Joe's. I don't know if I want to, if I just want to go home. Uh, like the weather is just like so weird today. And it is only 82 degrees which is crazy because it has been like really really warm so like the nice like the t change in temperature is really nice but um the quality of the air and all the ash and stuff is like kind of crazy and uh, it actually looks like it might rain so i don't know if like like you know like when it gets really hot and then really cold like or not really cold but a lot cooler really quickly um it usually like creates precipitation in the air so i don't know if it might like just like randomly start raining so who knows that that does happen sometimes though so yeah that's the update for now all right just got to the post office all right you guys just got the tj maxx home goods i was gonna go to um trader joe's but it was just too crowded like the line was so long to get in i didn't want to wait all right you guys i'm checking out the dinnerware. All of those little pumpkin like butter dishes. Look at those plates, they're so anthro -y.
they have so much Halloween stuff now, but it's like all like selling out. I wonder how much of the stuff they sell out of like every day. The art. Oh, this is nice. Hundred dollars. I remember when it used to be so hard to find like large art. And now here it is. At home goods. Oh my gosh, I love this little propaga propagation painting. <laughs> Ooh, look at that would be cute for plants. I saw this and it looked pretty cool. This is super cool. $80. Handcrafted in Indonesia. This little side table is cool too. Oh no, the little the little yellow side table with the inlay is gone. Oh no. How sad, I love that thing. How oh, cute is little pom pom thing. Basket, giant salt lamp. Oh, look at this. Oh my gosh, the giant monkey to the crown. Oh, look at the chubby little bird. Ooh, stones. Look at this, this is cool. 40 bucks. These are interesting too. But I want like one of those like rough, cool geode things. But I don't see any right now. That vase is pretty cool, or vessel. The little stool's fun too. Little tassels or fringe. Oh, I kind of like this too. I kind of want that cloche, but I want like a larger one. So I'm gonna keep a lookout. Ooh, don't move. Don't see any Le Creuset today. There's a Voss water. Snack. Tea time, kitchen, storage, solution. I'm looking for like a little shelf thing, but I don't think I see any. Oh my gosh, how fun is this? It's like a cooler. <gasps> how cool. <laughs> I like that. The line is all the way back there. It goes all the way around and winds that way. The line is out of control. All right, you guys, I am in my car, but I actually just parked in front of Target. Didn't get anything at um, Home Goods, and like, actually, it wasn't too bad of a thing because the line was so, so long. Like, it went all the way to the back of the store, and that line, like, literally goes all the way to the front and, like, winds around and then goes back around and then to the cash register. So, it was crazy how long that line was. But, um, anyway, let's go to Target. I want to see if they have any more, like, Halloween decor, because I've been hearing from a lot of people that a lot of the stuff is already gone. And 
I want to see. Like all of like the fall stuff is pretty much gone. And that's pretty much what happened when I went to the other Target that I was at like a few days ago. And I really wanted to check out again those Studio McGee pillows because I feel like I really like those for fall. Um, so let's see. Oh man, it's almost all gone. I don't even think these are the McGee pillows. I think these are just regular threshold. Yeah. Yikes. Oh, these are pretty. These are pretty. Magnolia wreath. These are the only pillows they have left. This one's not one of them, but I think this one is. A Studio McGee pillow. It is. I do like it. Is this one one of them too? I don't think so. Okay, so I did not know that they carried dried flowers here. And these dried proteas are really pretty. I'm trying to figure out how much they are. I think they might be $15. I got a bunch of these flowers. Let's look for a vase and see how they kind of look inside. Okay, I kind of like put one together with a Studio Mickey vase. It's actually kind of pretty. Um, these are like plastic, though. The rest are actually dried florals. I don't know about these plastic ones, though. But everything else looks really pretty, but it's kind of like monotone, which is why I wanted green. Let's see, it looks for something else. I'm gonna hold on to everything right now though. I added even more stuff to it and like I like it even more now. Even though I don't really like these little leaves too much, but like all together I really like it. Man, am I gonna spend like how much is this? 30, this is 15, 1, 2, 3, 4. So that's 4 times 15, 20, 4, 5, 6. That's 60 plus the base is 30, 90. 95, 100, 100, 510 for this whole little thing. All right, so I'm like trying it in front of the hearth and hand faux window display, and I'm really liking it. I add, I found um, this branch too, and another one of these to add in. I feel like it's so pretty. Now I feel like I have to take it home, but it's gonna be like over a hundred dollars worth of faux florals. <laughs> well, dried florals and then faux florals. The dried ones are $15 each bunch, and then the faux are $5 per um, branch. It's so cute though. I probably don't need the vase because I probably have something else that I can use, but this is just so pretty. Uh, how cute is this thing? Magnifying glass action. Why do I love this bowl so much? The texture on it is amazing. $20. Gorgeous. So, Studio McGee says that I need to buy the vase with the flowers. So now I feel like I need to buy the vase with the flowers. Alright, I ended up getting all the flowers in the vase. So I just got home and mom made this delicious beef with broccoli. And she's over here making something else. She's making picadillo. Yeah. So she's cutting up all the veggies and then she's gonna saute them up. Hey guys, okay, so it's the end of the night and I'm just hopping on to say good night. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. Hope you guys had fun. I had so much fun at Target. Um, stay tuned for like when I arrange the faux botanicals because I think I'm gonna make like a separate video just for that. Um, oh yeah, it should be fun. Okay, love you guys so much. Don't forget to check out this morning's different video and a new one goes up tomorrow by early at 7 a.m. and the vlog is up at 2. I'll see you guys all then. Right, bye!